Senate and House Republicans organized a press conference today to discuss securing Arizona's border and updates on current bills. Senate President Warren Peterson and others gave updates on recent bills that have been vetoed by Governor Katie Hobbs, such as SB 1231, which would make border crossings a state crime, and other bills that will make their way through the legislature. As Republicans, we wholly welcome legal immigration, and we understand all of the benefits that come with legal immigration. What we're talking about here is the illegal act. We are talking about broken laws. But Republicans aren't giving up on that bill. And in fact, a mirror bill was making its way through the House under House Bill 2821. Governor Hobbs' veto pen leaves the state of Arizona with no ability to protect its citizens against the invasion at our southern border. Sheriff Mark Lamb, who's running for U.S. Senate this November, praised Republicans for their attempts to help out law enforcement regarding immigration. The legislative branch is now saying, hey, here's some bills that address the concerns of the sheriffs and law enforcement, and now it's up to you, the governor, to say, yep, we're going to sign these bills into action. Republicans said more immigration bills dealing with everything from child trafficking to punishment for fentanyl dealers are making their way through the legislative process for the governor to act on. Republicans did not disclose a confirmed time frame of when these bills will be seen, but announced that the series of bills are on their way.